Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Music Marketing TV. I'm Dan D, and thanks for tuning in to Making Presets with FL Studios Harmer. So, at the end of this video, I'll be giving you guys uh, some free presets to play around with, some leads, some, some synths, uh, some bass lines, some cool things. And uh, I'm going to show you guys how to create your own and save it. Um, here's a little one-two of what you guys will be getting. You guys got a lead, some bass line, uh, some wapple chords is what I call them. All right, so let me just check. Let me just uh, give you guys an example. So you have a wapple chord right here. Oh, too high in the octave. Wapple, wapple, right? And we have something called a roar. And I'm using this in this in a different way than I originally intended to. Right, so you can use it as a lead. However, um, you can also use it like so as a bass line. So depending on how hard or how um, soft you hit, it will determine the dubstep kind of wob uh, wobble effect. Right, and we're gonna make a new one today. Uh, I feel like this this little song of mine is missing something, so we're gonna create something. All right, we're gonna create something new. So let's go ahead and open up uh, another Harmer. All right, so here it is, default, and I need a little bit of some chord action happening in my song, and uh, we're gonna create something totally different than I usually do. Right, so right now we have a, a saw-y kind of uh, waveform happening. Alright, so let's see. I need some attack. And at the end of it, let's have a little uh, wobbling tail. Alright, so it's going to sound a little spacey. Okay. Um, so the first thing we should do is mess around with the envelope alright so I'm gonna just enable it so now if I enable it you can see that this ADSR or envelope is you know working so in the beginning we have this attack right so it, it gradually goes up there when I press the key and if I hold the key it's gonna go down to this level alright so it's a decay then it sustains right here until I let go and we have a release, right? And it has a little, uh, I guess, a little fade happening, right? So let's get rid of the attack, because we don't want one. We want a quick one. But we also don't want to decay and let, have it drop and sustain here. Let's keep it high up. See? And then the release, that sounds good. We want a release. Uh, we want to have a wobbling release, though. All right. Um, so first thing uh, we should do here is enable the snap to tempo, tempo bass time. All right. Okay. Now, in order to get that wobbling effect, we mess around filter one frequency, right? Right. So just by moving the mouse, I go up and down, and we get that wobbling effect. Uh, let's sing, let's make that more intense by adding some um, resonance, right? Cool. Now let's see. We have to we have to mess around with this to make sure it fluctuates. So let's go under here, go under filter one frequency, and then over here, let's go to the LFO. Here we go, and let's enable it. And I'm just the speed. And I don't like it. I never usually have it all the way up. I usually have it somewhere, somewhere there. You know, if I actually here, if we go here and snap the tempo, it will lock to, yeah, right there. Good. Cool. 
And we can use this point to intensify it. Also change the tension. We'll just keep it at normal, at default. And now it's also wobbling right away. We also don't want it to rub, wobble right away. So this little point here does intensify, but it can also delay our wobble effect. So let's go all the way to the right. And it's still kind of uh, happening a little too early. So let's unzoom and let's just take it all the way out. There you go. So it's pretty much infinite now. And then when I let go, it starts to wobble. All right, let's keep going to make sure there is none. There is no wobble effect in my sustain. Okay. Now let's go ahead and save that first because you guys need to have that in there so I'll put it under my dandy category here and we're gonna go wapple whoops all capital wapple tail wapple tails let's do that cool okay so thanks for watching the preset presence um, again you'll be getting a whole bunch of cool presets let me just show you one more time under my dandy I haven't showed you this one this is Mr. Roboto If I go down in the octave, uh, we can use it as a bass line. Right? And yes, you can also use it at the higher. Right? And uh, the higher octave, and we can also add some cool effects. You know, this is up to you guys. Cool. And let's look at some other ones here. The roar. Right, you guys get some of that. Let's go down again. Got Wapple. Wapple, Wapple, it's really talking to me. And of course, the Wapple Tails. Cool. Alright, so that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace!